Having the 14 inch blade on the MX saw was great. You don't have to rotate the pipe as much when you're cutting eight, 10, six inch pipe. It's a lot safer than having to keep rotating the pipe. It helps you make a straighter cut also. We were surprised to see the saw have a 14 inch blade. It's better for cutting concrete when you're cutting floors. It goes deeper so you don't have to worry about that and then you get more cuts out of a blade. Having a 14 inch blade, you can cut more at once and it just makes the job quicker. I was impressed with how quick it started and how powerful it was. Being able to just push a button and be able to go right away is, is awesome. I think the uh, power and speed of the MX fuel cutoff saw is very fast. Compared to the gas, it's as fast if not faster. Pull it out, the battery on, and start cutting. Well, the MX fuel fit the bill for having a lot of power. You're going to be able to cut through that thicker steel and thicker cast iron a lot faster. And also the fact that you don't have to buy gas and then also buy the oil and pre-mix everything before it goes into the saw. You're just plugging in the battery and you're going a lot more efficient that way. The new MX Fuel cutoff saw, it's faster, no gasoline, it's lighter, and you can work indoors safely and comfortably. It's definitely not as noisy as a, as a typical gas saw. It doesn't vibrate as much. It's, it's a pretty smooth operating tool. It functions great, did everything it was set out to do. I could see MX Fuel changing the way we work because of how portable it is. I feel like it's more reliable, you know, safer and just better. Well-built, powerful, everything it should be.